Okay, we're here at 22457 DeKalb Avenue or Drive no, in I, I Avenue yeah. in uh, Calabasas. Now, we obviously cannot check every pipe in the house, but we are, there is a four inch cleaner located where the pipe exits out that we'll run our camera from. We're actually running it from a two inch cleaner behind the kitchen sink because we like to check as much of the line as possible. Obviously, we cannot check every pipe in the house. So we have a real small little micro camera in here, which goes about 30 feet in, which actually, running from the two inch kitchen line, we're actually outside of the house, and we'll continue our inspection from there. <coughs> Bringing the camera back, I think that's, the, that's clean the clean out outside, ABS plastic. And then it comes underneath the house to a cast iron main line. It's obviously getting a little old. This look, doesn't look too bad over here. It does have a little bit of rust build up, but it look this is the main line picking up the toilets and stuff. It doesn't look too bad at all. This was the only clean out for us to go through. Now we're coming back to a smaller pipe here where there's like a lot of grease in the line. The kitchen line, yeah. the kitchen line over here. We could only get our little teeny micro camera in there, which we're able to check anyway. I mean, you can see it has a little bit of grease, but it doesn't look too bad. We couldn't get our small camera in there because it was a little choked up, especially like round about here. It gets a little choked up over here. It's a kitchen line that's very common, that's very normal. Okay, so here it comes out of this little clean out here at the back of the house. Um, we'll go ahead, pause the recording, and we're going to run our camera from the clean out in the front. Okay, so we're running the camera from the clean-out locator where the pipe exits the house. It's right here by the front door on the left-hand side in the little flower bed near the water shut-off over here. clean-out on the left by the garage is for the laundry room. And that's for the laundry room there, huh? Yeah. Uh, so anyway, we're running the camera out and we're all the way out to the city connection. So there's the city sewer right here. There's your connection to the city right there. So we're going to bring the camera back. It's a six inch clay lateral coming back from the middle of the street towards the property. Looks pretty clean, the line. Nice, a little bit of roots coming in, very minor. In fact, that's probably just a bit of debris in the line there. <coughs> this all looks pretty good, nice and clean. As it comes onto the property, changes to a four inch clay pipe now there are some roots coming through the back of the y over there these can be easily cleaned out from this clean out over here you may need some periodic cleaning not going to cause a blockage at this time we always recommend you never flush tampons baby wife paper towels this all looks nice and clean here now right over here is where the laundry ties in underneath the bush over here in the front yard that's like four feet deep over there you see it's sunken down really bad over here very bad connection over here things can get caught over there we're going to recommend that this be repaired it's four feet deep over there underneath the bush <coughs> come continues coming back with clay pipe underneath the driveway this all looks good Except for that little connection out there, this all looks pretty good over here. That's that fine. comes back to some cast iron pipe. That's back to ABS plastic over here. So this all looks good over there. We're going to go over to the um, to that little washing machine clean out on the outside of the house now. Well, we're running the camera from that clean out located outside the garage here by for the laundry. Now we've got a little bit of cobwebs on the on the on the lens, but it's all ABS plastic. It ties into that spot where we located the line sinking down. So everything looks pretty okay, uh, except for that piece that's sinking down. The kitchen obviously has some grease in the line. 
periodic cleaning will probably be necessary for sure. I will stop the recording over here.